All right, Morgan, uh, first, I guess, how are you feeling? Yeah, uh, I felt good. You know, I had a chance to skate over the break while the team was on the road and, um, you know, do lots of maintenance here with uh, the training staff. And, I mean, it's been good. You know, we've had lots of communication. I think we know where we're at. And, uh, I mean, now it's just up to me to put in some more work and try to get back. Do you think you'll be able to be an option tomorrow? Uh, I'll know more tomorrow. I think I think at, at this point it's kind of more about how um, the body responds. So, you know, in the morning I think I'll know a bit more. And um, But, I mean, I want to do, you know, just about everything I can to, to come back as soon as possible. So whatever that is, uh, I'll do. Is there a, for you, what would you think would be the biggest challenge coming back? Is it, you know, pain? Is it the fact that you've only had the um, one full practice here? Yeah, I think it's a little bit of both. I think it's, you know, managing the pain, managing... You know your lungs after not playing for a while and you know I mean this is a big road trip we're playing lots of good teams and so I mean you want to do everything you can to come back and uh, I mean it's a challenge just playing these teams when you're healthy so um, you know it's about trying to get as healthy as you you can and uh, you know making a difference for your team. After going through a full practice did you feel any limitations in terms of what you were able to do and what you need to be able to do? Um, he, here and there but you know it's all stuff that I can manage I think and um, you know I mean it's up to me to take care of it and um, I mean, make sure I'm doing everything I can to, to make sure that I feel good tomorrow and I have an opportunity to, to come back and help the team. Did your all-scary plans change because of the injury? Uh, no. no, no, I was planning to be here the whole time. And um, I mean, I spent a little more time at the rink than I had planned. But other than that, uh, no, it's all the same. Were you able to skate almost right away after the injury happened? Uh, it, it took some time. I think that I got a little bit ahead of myself. I tried to skate a bit too soon. But I mean, um, you know, the training staff here is great. And, you know, they pulled me off pretty quick. but. You know, I think I've come a long way since then, and uh, so I mean, I'm looking forward to the next couple of days trying to get back. And um, I mean, like I said, I just want to get back to help the team. What do you make of the first half of the season for this team? I'm, I know you guys had your kind of expectations in the room. I'm not sure a lot of people outside thought you'd be in the spot you are now. What are your expectations for the second half? Uh, I think they're high. I think we're happy with where we're at in the standings. Um, you know, I think we, I mean, we've gone on stretches where we've played outstanding, and you know, we've really grown a lot as a team. And you know, we've kind of put ourselves in a spot where. Um, you know, we can approach the next couple of weeks, next couple of months, and, you know, really make a push at this. And, you know, we're very happy with that. And, you know, we have a long way to go as a group. But, um, I mean, we're uh, we're moving in the right direction. What's the biggest challenge where you're facing a condensed schedule like you are, 35 games coming up in about 69 days? It's tough. Um, I mean, you got to manage it. Uh, I mean, you got to take care of the body. Um, and, I mean, at this point in the season, every game counts. So, you know, we have to treat it accordingly and um, I mean make sure we're all on the same page so I mean over the next couple of days we're gonna have some meetings and you know get together as a group and make sure that we're uh, we're ready for the next couple of months. Do you put a value on team stability in terms of you've been here three or four years of always something there's gonna be a trade there's gonna be a coaching move and you know kind of smooth waters as far as that goes does that translate do you think to the team's record this year? Um, I think more than that I think that the environment around the team and around the room is 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 pretty comfortable. I think that you know we all know where we stand, and um, I mean that's that's been done from management down to coaching staff down to the the leadership group on this team. And I think that I mean when guys know where they stand and guys are comfortable, and um, you know they come to the rink every day and they know what to expect. I think that that helps, and I think that you know that's a good work environment. And I mean when you have that, guys want to be here. Guys want to work hard for one another, and uh, I think that's what we've created. What do you think an NHL playoff race is going to be like down the stretch drive here? And what sort of experience do you think that's um, going to be like? I mean. I think it's going to be, uh, you know, great uh, learning experience for us. But I mean, that being said, we're not approaching it like a chance to learn. I mean, we, you know, we want to be there. We want to, um, you know, be leading the pack. So, uh, I mean, the next couple of weeks and months, you know, we're going to have a lot to learn. But you know, I mean, I think it's important every day that we come in and we work our our hardest as a group, and you know, we try to make a push at this. And um, I mean, it's about winning games, not just always. Uh, I mean, learning. So, you know, we want to be in the driver's seat and you know, win some games. You, you, on that point, you said. You know, expect to win. That's something Mike has said. Do you feel like the confidence from game one to, to now has, has jumped in that regard? Yeah, yeah. I think that, I mean, we have the confidence. We know what we're capable of. And, um, I mean, we believe that, you know, we're a team that, you know, has a chance to win every night regardless of who we're playing. So, I mean, that's the attitude that we have to have moving forward because every game now, you know, between now and the end of April is, is, is meaningful. And, you know, it's a cool situation to be in for a group that hasn't been there a lot in the past.